Well, Grant, a 1-1 one, one draw at Bournemouth, not many clubs are going to come here and go away with anything. You must be proud of the players' effort. I'm disappointed, if I'm going to be honest with you. Um, the boys deserve more, you know, the, the shift that they put in today. Um, we've come to a team that, let's be, let's be honest, they should be winning the league by, by a country mile, really, with, with the squad they've got here and, and, and the budgets, etc. Et Scott's, you know, obviously just come into this job and I'm sure he'll get there at some point because I'm... I think he's he's really good in terms of what he does, um, but the goal's disappointing for us. You know, we've just watched it back in the in, in the changing room. It's it's just one lapse of concentration from us as a team. You know, all day we locked out Solanke. You know, we made sure that you know reason why we played Josh Knight there was the just to go against him and be a bit more physical and let Ronnie be a bit more freer and Frankie on the ball on both sides. Uh, and the one lapse of concentration from us as a team, we didn't lock the ball out from a, from a long kick. It's landed the slanky, and, and they break on us. But I can't be more proud of the boys in terms of their effort. That is what we're about, you know. That that is the intensity, the aggression. Um, everyone fighting for the badge and fighting for this football club. Um, and I and I was proud of their performance tonight, apart from one lapse of con uh, concentration. Yeah. For me, you should have had a penalty inside the first <laughs> ten minutes. It's look, look blatant push on on Jono, and you can easily let your heads go when when that kind of thing happens. But you got your nose is in front. Great finish from Chad Marriott, and, and positive from Joe Ward to, mm -hmm. to obviously, you know, ignore that, try and get the ball through to him, and that's what you want from Joe. I think we've seen a lot more positivity tonight, than we? Particularly from Harrison and Joe in, in those wide areas. I thought Joe was outstanding, really, really good in terms of what he'd done. You know, maybe in the last one there he slides it across the box, we score. But you know, when he plays like that, Joe's hard, hard, hard to play against. And Harrison again, really disciplined. The both of them had to do a good job defensively, but also break quickly on transitions. Um, you're right, it was a stonewall penalty, and John, was, you know, I knew it right at the time. Well, you know, why would my centre forward, you know, fall when he's about to head the ball in the back of the net? But again, the shift from the boys, great to see Jack score. I think that's his hundredth league goal. He tells me in the changing room, if you didn't know, so I've just told you. Yeah, um, Jack would know. Yeah, so I think that's his hundredth league goal. Um, you know, brilliant for him. You know, considering you know the lads had a, a bit of injury problems, etc. Um, and you know, when he gets in them sort of positions, he don't he don't miss. Nice to see Jack Taylor on the, 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 the starting lineup today. I mean, was that a, a difficult decision to make? Because he obviously only, only had 45 minutes in the 23s. It was. I mean, we were toying with the idea to do we start him, do we bring him off the bench? You know, he's a big player for this football club. Um, the way them three performed in there tonight John Doe, Ollie, Jack, excellent. You know, they're playing against top players Cantwell, Billings, Cook. Um, it was a real battle in there for them tonight. Um, you know, we, we were talking about how long do we give him. He felt good. Um, and again, look, when we've got people like Sammy Smorich, you know, George Grant on the bench, young Kwame Puck, who's come with us today, um, Reese Brown's come with us. The squad's good. Everyone's fighting for places, which is which is what we want. Yeah, it's a difficult decision, actually, when you look at the squad, because you had no Hayden Coulson, no Callum Morton. There was a couple of others that didn't make the journey. I guess that's the toughest part of management, isn't it, when you're telling players that they're not travelling? It is, but like I said during the week, it's, it's important that I see these, these players, you know, that... I still want to see a wee bit more of Bali Mumba, but you know we haven't got round to it yet. Um, but it's important to see them. I think it was great to see young Joe Taylor come off the bench. Um, he's deserved that. You know the boys have just given him a round of applause in the change room. Um, we've finished the game with four teenagers on the bench all through the all through the academy, and and that's that's what we're about as a football club. We want to try and promote, give these boys an opportunity when they deserve it. Um, and look all round, we're pleased. We're pleased that we've come here and shown a real grit, gritty determination about us. But also, really, uh, when we went forward, we're dangerous. But obviously, disappointed to concede that goal.